Hi everybody and welcome to the Upside Dan. I got to see Coldplay live at River Plate in 40X and I'm here to tell you how the concert movie was in the 40X format. Before I get started on my quick thoughts for the film, and if I recommend it for you in the 40X format, please make me your 40X guy. Please, please, please like and subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you don't miss any more 40X content from me. Quick backstory, I do like Coldplay's songs. I didn't really know much about the band. I just listened to their, you know, more popular songs. I wouldn't call myself a huge fan. I don't dislike them. It's just I'm not a huge fan, but I like them and I like their music. So I really went to this to see how a concert movie was in the 40X format because I was like, eh, it seems I don't know what they would do. It was more about that than it was even being a fan of Coldplay because I would not have seen this movie otherwise. If you're a Coldplay fan, I think you should definitely go see this film. They did a great job filming the audience, the performances, the songs, a lot of drone shots and different weird editing choices, different, you know, out there stuff going on on screen. And I thought it was really colorful, really well done, you know, really out there, really fun. It added to the experience. They played a lot of their greatest hits and you had Jin from BTS there and you had H-E-R, her. It was a cool Cool, cool experience. I am happy that I went because I just thought a lot of really good camera work and editing choices and visuals were on display here and it was just fun to kind of be in a crowd watching them perform the music and hearing the music and the loudspeakers and seeing all of the cool visuals that they put on screen like weird colors, weird symbols, weird shapes, weird camera shots and camera angles. They did a lot with this film to make it a more memorable experience than just watching someone sing. And I enjoyed Coldplay. Chris Martin and his band you can tell that they're good people and that they just want acceptance for everyone they want togetherness they want happiness they want love I really think that came off very great in this movie when Jin from BTS was there that was one of the highlights of this movie I loved what they did he sung the astronaut which has become my favorite song right now you know since seeing the film and it was such a touching touching moment they did a great job with that her was very cool as well I really enjoyed seeing her she's very good at playing you know the guitar and she's a really good singer. Same with Jin and BTS. I really like seeing these two guests. Just Jin is there so BTS they do sing My Universe but BTS is kind of just there on the screens or you know holograms. Not not of them but you know just visions of them. Jin comes at the end and it's a really sweet moment that I definitely recommend watching and hearing that song. I thought it was really good and really well done. Even towards the end they have an actress that was actually exiled from Iran come up and sing this Iranian protest song and I thought that that was a very beautiful moment. The actress is Golcha Fateh for Hani. She did a really good job. They all were just harmonizing up there with her seeing this powerful, powerful Iranian protest song. And I thought that that was a very good moment. It just showed everyone's humanity. During the credits, you do get some unseen footage, unseen documentary kind of stuff. I actually thought that the whole film was kind of going to be a documentary throughout. You see some of their songs, then you get some more background and behind the scenes. But it's the concert, and then at the end, during the credits, there's some extra footage and stuff uh, and documentary type things. They bring up how much they love everyone. They thanked everyone not only in the auditorium but in the cinemas watching and I thought that, that was really cool. And as for the 40X experience, I was blown away. This is an amazing 40X experience. If someone has a concert movie that you're a huge fan of, I definitely think it's worth it. If you're a Coldplay fan, I think this is 100% worth it. You can't use Unlimited. I couldn't use Unlimited. You pay $23 where I'm at. But I think if you're a Coldplay fan, definitely go see it in 40X. They used a lot of the capability they just didn't usually use water. They used some fog. The lights were cool. It was like you're actually at a concert. There was definitely a few songs where they used it more than other songs that just didn't use the lights or the fog. They used them to the best of their ability. The seats were moving pretty much through the whole film, like especially if it's a fast song. But even if it's a slower song, you kind of feel something in your seat. There's rocking, there's swaying. It's like they're tapping the foot. They're flinging you back and forth. You're going to the beat of the drums, of the guitars, of the music in general. You're going through the dance moves that the people on stage are doing, the motions that the audience audience is doing whatever the shot is on you're going through the motion of the shot wind was blowing basically everything but water kind of wasn't used and some of like the punches in the seats and massagers and stuff they they weren't used there but the seats were moving a lot almost the whole time and sometimes it was throwing you around and there's a lot of air blowing because it's an open arena the lights especially during this one song I mean there are a few songs but especially during this one song like you were at a rock band concert this was incredible I thought they did a great job putting this in 40x which is why like if you're a huge fan of Coldplay, I definitely recommend it in 40X. In the future, if they bring more concert movies and you're a huge fan of them, so say you're not a huge fan of Coldplay, I think that this could be a fun experience. Now, this concert that Coldplay put on seemed like it's just an extraordinary show. An extraordinary show. So maybe not everyone will put on it as an extraordinary show, so that won't 
translate that well to 40x as well as this at least they put on a great show the movie you just shows that that they they put on a great show at river plate in buenos aires i will say though if you're not a coldplay fan you won't get as much about out of the movie because even me i i like them like i said i like some of their songs i was kind of at times waiting for the end it's such a fun movie in 40x i definitely recommend it Coldplay fans get to it on April 23rd. There's one more at April 23rd in 40X. Go check it out if you're a huge Coldplay fan. They're definitely worth it in the 40X format. If you've liked what you've seen here and you want to see some more content from me, please click around here to see some other content from me. Please like this video, comment on this video, share this video with the movie fans in your life, hit that notification bell, subscribe, Make me your 40X guy and come to the upside, Dan.